Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today is a very exciting day. I feel like I say this every single time I start a new series, but it really is. Today we are headed off to Florida for two weeks. We are staying at Disney World for four nights. We are then going on a Disney cruise aboard the Disney Wish, the newest of the Disney Cruise Line ships. We are then headed back to Disney World for five nights and we are running all three of the springtime surprise runs. Just to add to the excitement, we are just about to leave for the airport and today we are doing something we've never done before is me, my mum and Debbie travelling and we are going into one of the airport lounges at Manchester Airport which is so, so exciting. We've never done it before and we thought, why not? Now's the chance. So I'm literally just about to walk out of my house, I'm going to go and pick those guys up and we are going to head to the airport, so let's go. That is a skill. One hand, two cases. <laughs> One of the cases is being pulled by your little finger. <laughs> Does that not hurt? <laughs> We have made it through security, we're just about to head to the lounge, but just wanted to say, that was the most easy security, we have one bag between three of us which we've dropped off, and that was super easy, and we've uh, been through security, I think it took us like seven minutes, and we are now headed to the lounge, our flight doesn't leave for like three hours, so we're just going to go and relax. Wow, here we are, so this is the, is it still breakfast? Or is it lunch? It's still breakfast, we might get both then. This is amazing. So this is my breakfast offering. It does say on the menu they have vegan sausages, but it's currently 11.23 and I think lunch must start at 11.30 because they've already started putting the signs out. So I'm gonna have this for breakfast and in like 10 minutes when it's lunch, I'm gonna get something for lunch. So this is the best thing ever. This is like mid because there's still breakfast food out, isn't there? Yeah. So we've got ready salted crisps, tortilla chips and salsa. And then egg, chicken or what was the third option? Tuna. Tuna sandwich. And then like cheese and crackers. How good is this? It's actually an open bar. You can get basically beer, spirits or wine. There's like loads of choices. But Debs has gone up and got some Bucks Fizz. I don't actually drink this, they're both for Debs. <laughs> but uh, we thought we'd get for a cute photo. All right, lunch has started. We've got curry, potatoes, pasta, something else. There's still some breakfast stuff though, to be fair. And then we've still got sandwiches and crisps over here, and cheese and fruit, and uh, pastries. So it's kind of like a mixture at the moment. So everything is labeled vegetarian, vegan, gluten-free. So I have the potatoes, the curry, and I got this like orzo salad thing as well. There was pasta but I'm assuming it's like egg because it wasn't labelled vegan and I don't know what that is, it didn't have a label. This has genuinely been the most relaxing and best airport experience I've ever had. It's about an hour to our flight so I think we've been here for about two hours. I've genuinely had about 10 plates of food, no lie, it's all been really nice. I've had about 10 glasses of lemonade. I am doing like half ones just in case but a lot and I had some orange juice, genuinely the best thing ever, would highly recommend. But our gate is now up, it's over there, we can't read it, but it's, there are screens in here, so you can see if you want to. Uh, we're gonna go check out what our gate is and we're gonna head over and hopefully get on the flight, I guess. Guys, this day keeps getting better. You will not believe this. We have all been upgraded to premium economy. I've never been in premium. I've never been in business class, first class or anything. I always sit like back row of the plane, cheap skate section. We are in premium. I cannot believe it. This is the most exciting thing that's ever happened. Oh and God. she's given us a ticket to Rasna. No yeah, there are. So we're Rasna. sat in row 25 and me and Debs are gonna sit next to each other apparently and Rachel's gonna sit in row 21. I don't but mind we're all in premium and they're, oh my God, I can't. I'm gonna show you everything. I'm so excited. I can't believe it. Guys, we're in group two. We're literally the first ones on the plane. I have never ever been more excited in my whole life. This is Rachel's seat. She's in 21. She gets the front row. Oh my gosh. 
Oh my word, 24. So this is me and Debs. This is the best thing ever. This is our TV. Our table is in our arm. I don't know how it gets out though. Look at this. So this is our table. You can push it out and in. Wow, 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 wow. Oh. <laughs> so you get a foot rest and also wait go back again so I can show how it goes back look how far back it goes this is the best day ever I can't believe it we are easily amused if anyone was wondering but still the newest discovery in premium economy is in this bit there's a little pocket here and it's got a USB in it how good is that? So you can like put you your phone in your, there. You can put your earphones can in you? there. Let's try it. Yes, they fit. Mine are in it. Wait. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Where's your phone? Or is it in standing there. up? I just stood it up inside. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. there we go. Ta-da! Oh, we're so excited about the pocket. <laughs> <laughs> They're bringing round drinks. Me and Debs are just in our element right oh, now. Yeah. We could get used to this. We could. Just a picture of the glasses. Yeah. Um, Let's no, I mean, see I what we've got. Um, oh yeah, you. What was it that you watched? watched uh, Something to do with a singer. Elvis. Oh Elvis. Nothing like is really calling my name specifically. Oh, is that the new Matilda? I might watch that. That's cute. Oh, last time they had the Minions movie. Have they not got that anymore? They have which one? The Minions. You know the new Minions oh, yeah, one? I watched that uh, yesterday. Oh, <laughs> really? Yesterday Was it good? Not too bad. I want to watch it, but I don't think it's on this time because I was going to watch it last time, but they must have changed them. Oh, I've not seen that yet. Oh, okay. Well, they haven't got Minions on anymore, but... I might watch the new Matilda, that seems like the best thing. So it's been what, about 25 minutes if that since we took off? I have a Fever Tree lemonade. Debs has got a red wine, which yeah. is the same as last time. But you get them in glass rather than plastic and pretzels slightly salted they are vegan if i remember correctly but we've just been given a menu so how good is this starter quinoa butternut squash and crumbled feta cheese salad mains you can have chicken casserole shepherd's pie or thai green veg curry and dessert is chocolate and caramel crust and then later like at the end of the flight you get cheese and pickle sandwich and egg mayo sandwich and then a lemon posset shoe and walnut carrot cake and a warm scone buttercream and strawberry jam and then there's a drinks list on the back what oh yeah that's what it is oh my god we have to go find that if you're feeling a bit peckish i've seen this on adam hatton if you know who he is i've seen this on his vlogs there's a wonder wall and it just has really good snacks we're gonna have to go find that i told you vegan yeah but none of them are vegan so i don't know what i'm gonna eat this could be an issue because obviously we didn't actually plan to be in these seats but hopefully there'll be something i can eat if not i did have like five courses in the lounge so um i don't know about my meal because obviously it might be a bit confusing but this is deb's meal she went for the thai green curry Ooh. okay that looks good and then we have bread and butter this was like the salad and the chocolate caramel cake and you get these which are salt and pepper shakers and as far as i'm aware you're allowed to steal them what does it say on the bottom pinched from virgin atlantic sea so what was it oh chocolate and caramel crunch that's what it was how cute so i have magically been served a premium vegan meal don't ask me where it came from or anything or how it got here but I have this, I don't know what it is because it doesn't have a label. So it looks like rice and some kind of thing, fritter maybe. I then have a bulgur wheat or quinoa maybe, salad. I have a plate of fruit, which looks very nice. And then a bread roll and Virgin Atlantic, you're doing good, vegan butter. And then of course, the best part, the salt and pepper shakers that I am going to steal, which isn't stealing because they do have permission on the bottom. 
How amazing is this? I'm so pleased. Oh, and of course the, the two glasses with your cutlery inside. <laughs> so review on the meal, I would say effort was quite high, but it was kind of bland. This probably would have been nice, but I don't really like any of those items. I ate some of the rocket out of it. Um, the bread roll was just a bread roll, the fruit was nice. Um, and then this, it was okay, but it's just really bland. <laughs> Me and Debbie are quite delirious, I feel. <laughs> Deb's is um, curry, again, quite bland. She ate the starter and she said the dessert was really nice. So there you go. So next up, we have, we have five hours and 54 minutes to go. Me and Deb have got a hot drink each in a cute mug and they have oat milk so there we go we are yet to locate the wonder wall but we're on a mission we're gonna find it surely before the end of the flight <laughs> we're gonna find it it can't be that hard to find but anyway i guess this is it apparently <gasps> they've got naked bars olives oh my god i'm gonna get <gasps> oh my god they've got so much good stuff guys So there was literally so much stuff there, but I, I couldn't get everything. So I ended up getting a naked bar and some olives. And then Deb's has got pop chips, sour cream and onion. And we also have, I say I couldn't get everything, but we do have quite a lot. <laughs> sea salt crisps. There is so many options though. I'm definitely going to go back later. That is so good. And of course my tea. So we're about halfway through the flight. We've got four hours and 20 minutes, 23 minutes to go. And we've just been brought some organic ice lollies. So we're gonna enjoy these. And then apparently we're gonna try and nap because we wanna try and go to the fireworks tonight. I don't know how realistic that is, so please don't set expectations for that. But if we are awake up, our flight doesn't land until quarter past six uh, Orlando time. So by the time we get to the hotel, it might not happen. But if we have a nap, we're gonna try and see what we can do. Why am I watching Scooby-Doo? I don't know. Two hours to go. This is our final meal. Because it wasn't overly planned, I've not ended up with what I should. But I basically have like some bits of veg and hummus, a kind of salad that I probably won't eat, but the effort was there. Some pieces of fruit. I don't even know what this was. Oh, olive oil. Uh, and then some water. Deb's has, this is what was on the menu. So that must be the shoe corn carrot cake, a scone with cream and jam, and then like an egg sandwich and a cheese and pickle. Genuinely one of my favourite things about uh, Virgin Atlantic at the moment is they give out love hearts for landing. We are about, let's have a look, I'm still watching Scooby Doo, uh, 25 minutes away so we are very nearly there. made it to Orlando. We are just headed for the Sunshine Flyer. When we arrive at our hotel, which we're staying at All Star Movies by the way, if I haven't already told you. Oh, we found the Sunshine Flyers right there. I will update you on the whole situation, like what we thought of uh, going in premium and everything to do with the day. Of course, I'll give you a tour, but for now we are headed straight for the Sunshine Flyer. So I will also give you a, re a review of that as well because I've never been on it before. Guys, look at this, how hilarious is this? It's like a... Burger King hat, mm -hmm. except it's for the Sunshine Flyer. Baggage plane, to terminal A. The check-in for that was like really easy. It only took two seconds. There was only one like couple in front of us, uh, and that didn't take very long. We are now checked in. We have this like sticker that we kind of. I don't want to say stole because I think you're allowed to take them, but a cute sticker. And they basically said just wait in this area here, we're sat on the floor because there's no free tables, until they call you a hotel and you literally just go. So this is very good, hopefully it won't take too long. So far I've called uh, Pop Century Caribbean Beach Resort and now All Star Movie. Yay! Number one, they're playing Disney music in the background. Number two, that was literally two minutes. We sat down, I ate like three Doritos and then they called us. We are going to Pop Century 
Caribbean, Caribbean Beach, Jumbo House, and All Star Movie. So we don't know what order it is, but there is four resorts. But either way, we're on our way. So let's go. Also, I'm probably not going to film a montage because they've got like wraps on the window, so you can't really see. But it's basically just like fields and grass and lakes and stuff. So imagine, imagine that. Okay. Oops. Where's my case? Huh? Okay, so we've made it. We unfortunately we were the last hotel, so it probably took I don't know how long. I don't know what the camera's doing, not focusing, and I look raw. We were playing a game. We were playing Guess the Song. It was a uh, kind of ropey, but anyway, we are bypassing the check-in desk because using the app, we actually can just check in straight away. And our room is seven seven four three, I believe. Ooh, Easter. They did this last time. We've seen this before here. Oh, yeah, we seen him before. Oh, not in this one. Right, anyway. Whoa! Anyway, we're gonna go to our room. I'll show you guys that. We're then gonna come and explore the hotel. There's so much to do, even though it's like half nine at night. Anyway, stay tuned for everything that's about to happen. So, um, also, I forgot to say, we are in room 7743, I believe, and we're in the Lovebug section. We've never stayed at this hotel. I think I might have already told you this. It's been a very long day, so I can't actually remember what's happened and what hasn't. What? Whoa, the back, and there's the front. How fun is this? So, we're just double checking. Yeah, it is 7743. Okay, right, unlock door. Uh, yes, I agree. I've never done this before. Activating, please wait. Wow, cool. <gasps> okay, you guys can chill out there for a bit. <laughs> See ya. So, ooh, look, my name's on the TV. Welcome to Matthew's party. So, this is a refurbished room. It's very similar to the Pop Century room I stayed in if you watched my vlogs from last summer. So we have this pull down bed. I'll show you it pulled down because we are going to have to pull it down in a minute. And it has two plugs and two USBs here. We then move along to this section. Again, two plugs, two, two USBs, a phone, a massive bed. Same plugs over there. We then have an interconnecting door, but we're, it's just us, so we're not going to use that. This giant like dresser kind of unit with a Bible, a safe, it's quite a big safe actually, which is good. Not that we tend to use it, but you know. Drawers, three drawers there. More plugs up here. Two plugs, two USBs, same here. Obviously a ginormous TV. We then have bin, recycling and normal. A coffee maker, an ice bucket and a fridge. And then I shall show you guys also, I don't know if I showed you that art up there, but how cute. Bathroom. Oh, hooks, that is important for if you've got like a jacket. Not that you really need it, but if you come at a cold time of year, you might. And then a wardrobe. So it's got like a shelf up here. The one I stayed in had more shelves, which was probably more useful, but it doesn't matter too much. An ironing board. An iron. I don't know where the light is. And then you've got a sink. It is a singular sink because we're in a value hotel. Loads of flannels, face soap, a hairdryer, spare toilet roll, a giant mirror, and then like a little makeup mirror. And then in the bathroom, we have a bath with a shower. These are quite nice. I love the glass doors rather than the um, curtains because it's just a bit nicer. And then the H2O stuff. Apparently, I keep hearing they're getting rid of this, but every time I come, it's still here. They're attached to the wall. A nice one of these kind of showers. Obviously, you can have it as a bath. And then a toilet with a bunch of towels there. And that is it. So I can now go actually let the others in. Hopefully, they've not run away and left me forever. Come in, girlies. Oh, thank you. I know, they have. They're right here, check them out. There's How three, nice is it? Three of us sleeping in one bed. <laughs> That's fun. No, Debs, you're having that chair. <laughs> That's your bed. I think there's a bed in here. Maybe? Yeah, it pulls down. So we are now in the room and I just wanted to give you guys an update on the whole flight situation. So basically, as you all have seen, we got upgraded to premium. I've never been in premium before. We had a brilliant time. We had such a good flight, it was amazing. But my overall verdict is I would not pay for it. 
I don't, it is really good and if you have a specific reason for it, I would not say don't do it, it was really good. But I personally, in my situation, definitely wouldn't pay for it again, it wasn't that good. Also, as I showed you, we have like the pull down bed here and the double bed here, there's three of us. So to decide who gets to sleep where, where we're going to do the wheel of names, so I'll show you guys that in a minute. And then I think we're going to head up to the centre because we haven't actually really been in there because we just kind of scooted straight over here. And we're going to go kind of see what they've got there, so let's do it. We are ready. We ready, have, yes. I've put loads of names on just so it's not like a third each to make it a bit more interesting. Go for it. Ready? Whoever's name comes out gets that bed, the sofa bed kind of one, to okay. themselves. Ready? Mm -hmm. Three, two, one, go. Rach. Debs. Rach. Debs. <gasps> Rach. If you weren't sure, it's Rach. <laughs> oh yeah, it was the cast member. So this is what I was vaguely showing before, but I had like my suitcase with me. And basically, from what I can gather, the cast members decorate these eggs, and then you can vote for which one you think's the best. Which I think I would probably pick up. That's really good. They're all they're all quite impressive. They're all really good to be fair. These are the cups. Are you getting silver? You go purple. I want I want silver. We don't live together. We can have the same one. As long as we remember for this week. Look at this. Spring plant-based fling cupcake 5.99. That is fun. So I've ordered myself an impossible burger with fries and I've bought, we all in fact have bought one of the refill cups only because we have loads of them but because it's the 100 years and they're new cups we thought why not and that came to 37.93 for this and this in dollars including tax if anybody would like to know. It is now time for a peruse of the shop. They've got so much like 100 merch which is really exciting. Easter offerings. <gasps> Look, they've got Easter eggs. Oh my word. Cool. They've got some like totally different, like considering it's only been five weeks since we left, there's a lot of stuff in here that I've never seen before, which is rather exciting. So actually, I thought there wasn't gonna be any 50th stuff on deal because that's what I've heard, but apparently that soap dispenser, did it used to be $20? <laughs> used to be $20 and is now $8. So it turns out these ones, the 2023 soap dispensers, are also $8 now. But it's only April. <laughs> so why are they on deal? Who knows? Okay, here okay, comes the... Pull. Yeah, just pull it. Yeah. Woo! Oh my gosh. Whoa! Surprise. Look at that! Okay. I want this bed! You didn't win wheel of names. Just get off the bed. <laughs> you didn't win wheel of names so you get promoted. <laughs> but you have to share. Oh, home sweet home. So we are now back at the resort for the evening. Uh, it's, I don't know what time, somebody tell me. 20 to 10, which is 20 to 3 UK time. So it has been a rather long day, but genuinely one of the most exciting days ever. We are headed to Epcot tomorrow, so make sure to stay tuned for that vlog coming out very soon. It will be live next Thursday, 7pm UK time. Do subscribe so you don't miss it. And other than that, I'll see you guys next time with a brand new video. Bye!